Well, I had a package get lost in the mail and today it has finally shown up. Just over two weeks ago, I purchased someone's entire collection and what was special about this collection is it's all old Disneyland attractions. Inside this box here is two bags full of pins. I believe there's roughly 200 pins in there, so there's quite a lot to get through and there's a lot of really exciting ones. Yay. And here it finally is. I got so worried because this was sent by priority mail, which means it's supposed to take two days. It took 15 to get here, which is the longest I've ever had a package take the show up. So I am just very, very glad it's finally here. I do see they packed it with care, which is very nice. So I've actually never seen a bag like this Wait, before. it's so like it's... a suitcase. Oh, you know what? This is from the Disneyland Disneyland's 50th anniversary. So it's really cool Ooh. it has that logo there. <laughs> yeah, he did tell me this bag would definitely need to be repaired, so... Uh, the other one is okay though, uh, I believe. Okay, but, but that's a cool it, Yeah, it's definitely bag. a. <laughs> um, just glue that on. Yeah, the bag. whole front page is falling off, but that's all right. We don't care too much about the bag. It's more or less what's inside that counts. So let's go ahead and open it up. So our front page here. Ooh, ba -ba -ba -ba. And here we have the first page here. So what's really cool is the Disneyland little sign logo. There's Those... two different ones. Yeah, they are very similar, but definitely. Not quite the same at all. I don't even know which one I like better. Tinkerbell's a nice little slider, and then of course a bunch of ear hats from the 50th. But uh, there's definitely a lot more stuff that I was really excited for Ooh. in here. We do have some pins from the series. I don't know how many that we own, but Local it's definitely server. one that we don't come across very often. So it's really cool to have that. And there are also these ones which look to be like they're part the of a castle. set. I think it was another 50th anniversary set Aww. with all the attractions. Yeah, so as I mentioned, they, they definitely collected a lot of attractions, so there's a lot oh. of really cool stuff coming up in here. It's Tom Sawyer's Island, and it's floating. Oh my gosh, it's the boat. I didn't realize that moved. I like that thing. Oh yes, I see this building all the time from the, from the Kingdom of Cute series, but there it is, the House of Future, 1957. The tree house, and what's up? What does this open up to? It's a black and white photo of the character parade, it looks like. Ah. 65, so that was the uh, 10th anniversary of Disneyland. Spinner. Davy Crockett pins. They don't make too many of those. The only one I'm used to seeing ah. is the Countdown to the Millennium series Spin. one. Spin. Spin. It's like... Kind All right, you be careful with that. I don't want you breaking this pin so we look, can spin it. it. It's not that exciting. All right, I'll take your word for it. This Haunted Mansion one is really nice. It looks like it is missing one of the gates, though, but it's Sad. nice how it's got the, little, uh, the hitchhiking ghost there. And a tiki room. I mean, the Haunted Mansion's old. It could have just lost a door. All right, well, let's give Ooh. it a flip because there's definitely more exciting oh stuff coming God. up. Mission to Mars 1975. There we go, there we go. This is what it does, let's see. Oh. It slides out so you could actually see it a little bit better, like a little window. Oh, look, he's, he's literally waving. He's a nice guy. Oh, that one down there, that is the little e-tickets and it's a, it stamps oh, it up and down. Yeah, he looks like they put the uh, little hair ties on there so that way all the moving parts hopefully Ooh, won't break. That's a nice space one. And then and the Small World one, Small World Holiday it's 1997. Small. I wonder if that was the first year they did a holiday for like uh, Small ones. World. This one's kind of cool too. Cause yeah, the... it's a lenticular uh, Tower of Terror. Ooh. And then down here, there's the that's Disneyland what... castles. Oh, this is like a different color. And this is one of the pages I was really looking forward Ooh. to because this one has a lot of posters on it. So it's all the old attraction posters. Oh my gosh, instead of getting posters to hang up, we can just put the pin. And this series right here, so I thought this was super cool. So if you notice, all of these are retired attractions. So they are tombstones what? for their retired attractions. So it has their opening date and their closing one as well. So I thought that was a really cool series. It's also WDI LE300, I believe. Oh. Ooh, a people mover poster, the Monorail Cafe. And what is that? So the, oh, it's the uh, Disneyland Railroad with a spinner to give you the wait time. Wait time, 10 minutes. That, that's right. actually a really cool pin. And then the Mouseketeers and a Haunted Mansion. That's a cool Haunted Mansion. All right, let's get this flipped over to the next page. And look at that, there is more 50th Disneylands. Wow. All with the old iconic Disneyland logo. We did not have all of them, I thought we yeah, did. Yeah, I didn't realize how many there were they in this made set. A lot. But did yeah. they make 50? <laughs> I, I mean, That'd be a lot of it pins. It would be a lot of pins. <laughs> I mean, they would. 
But this is a really cool uh, haunted mansion. Oh, little records. And then flipping over here. They're little records. There's TVs and, and the retro. records. Do they come out and in? No. Nope, they're just solid like that, mm -hmm. but that's still really like cool. Them. Last page for this book, and we are finishing off with a bang. Check out what is in there. There's a bunch of e-coupons, including Splash Mountain, wow. a lenticular Twilight Zone, and look how huge that pirate is. That is a cool one. It is definitely a really nice one. And what is this uh, newspaper for? Uh -huh. that's, a, that's a nice one. A World of Color, Mouseketeers, and a Mouseketeer TV. Did it come with backer cards in here? Uh, what is that? Disney attraction posters. That actually could be some of the backer cards, which would be nice to have. They stuffed them in there, then. Oh. <laughs> I mean, I, that bag's done for. Yeah. Hopefully the other one uh, is in okay condition, but... I don't know what series those cards are for, and then a Walt one. Well, nice that we have some of them. Oh, it's the attraction posters. Oh, cool. Let's get this closed up because we're on the book, too. Ooh, this one's better quality. Oh, no, it's not. No, this one's falling apart, too. They must have just not made them great. Yeah, I mean, to be fair, the books are oh. almost 20 years old now, so. Let's just take the front and then glue it on <laughs> a, a different Repurpose book. it. Upcycle it. All right. First page off here. So this was... Oh, yes. Look at that. There is a whole little, uh... Ooh. Yeah, what is oh, back is here? Cute. Candlelight professional. Session. I love backer cards. Is there any for the good ones? Candlelight. I'm not seeing any of the limited edition backer cards, thick so... Thick keychain. This is a thick one. Anyways, so this first page, it contains a whole, I don't know if it's a whole set, there's probably a couple, yeah, it looks like they, they might have kept some or traded some along the way somewhere, but it's a lot of the attractions, which I believe is from a set that came out in 1998. The teacups. But yeah, there, there's a lot of cool, cool ones. Another House of Future, we got a lot of House of Future, and a Carousel of Progress. People Mover. People Mover. Disneyland. Oh, I didn't even realize that. Yeah, Disneyland's People Mover closed so oh long gosh, ago. Oh is this the rocket one? Ooh. And our next page here, That's a treasure. it's a uh, lenticular Tinkerbell oh, yes. and a ticket book, which flips open. Mm -hmm. And then a bunch of black and white photos of Walt over here. There's more attractions. That is a fancy haunted mansion. There's the enchanted tiki room, haunted mansion, small worlds. Oh, this is an interesting And one. what does that one say? Six Spectacular New Adventures, Disneyland 59 with the Skyway. Look at this. <laughs> what does that say? Children under six must be accompanied by an adult A coupon attraction. They have a bunch of the... We see this one. Oh right. my gosh, it's the Autopia one. So this is a heavily scrapped pen that you'll see on the boards every once in a while. But I can see the age on this pen. Oh, and that one's real. Yeah, this is definitely the authentic one. Does it this go was with part, like... It was part of the 50th anniversary pin set, so this Ooh. must have been the, uh, the set that it came in. I really like this one. All right, let's flip this over Ooh. and see what else is hiding over here. A Club 33? Oh my gosh, is that the real Walt Date head? night at Disney. It's the Walt head. Oh my <laughs> gosh. Uh, let's see. And then what else is here? C coupon or 25 cents? Empty the gun. Oh, that's the Frontierland shooting game, uh, huh? I like the ones that match the parks. Yeah, it's cool how there's so many Whoa, signs. What is that? And that, <laughs> that one, uh, I believe that's one of the paintings inside the Haunted Mansion. Oh. And the Country Bear. I've never seen that pen before. That is Aww. that is really awesome. I like the pirate one. This one. These creepy pirates. <laughs> you it's like the, the creepy OG pirates? The pirates. Creepy pirates. Over here, it looks like it's another sort of oh, set. I, I'm not familiar with it, but... They had a goofy oh, one. Oh, a goofy you lenticular. Go the it says, I'm goofy. That's silly. Let's see. And then there's a Mr. Oh. Toad. What attraction are they writing right here? Mm. I'm trying to figure that out. It kind of looks like an Atopia car. No, yeah. I can't tell, actually. Like the old space, maybe? And oh, you see the matching uh, lenticular <gasps> Mickey at the bottom oh, there? I think I have the Tinkerbell. Somewhere. I like Disneyland. <laughs> uh, me too, Mickey, me too. <laughs> 
Whoa! Oh my, that was quite the page to flip to. Whoa. Check this out. Yes, it's a haunt. It's a huge haunted mansion jumbo slider pen. Do they when, make bigger like? like not? Yeah, no, I, I, I've never seen a record pen this big. When I first saw this, I thought it was a fantasy, which means it's a fan made one. But uh, no, I was mistaken. I looked into it, and this is official uh, park pen. Um, is it like a one off, or they made other ones? Uh, no, I think this is. That's Actually, I, like, I can't say for sure, but uh, I've only seen the okay, but one. Okay, but wouldn't it be cool if they made one like this and the whole thing came out and was a record? Oh, yeah, I go <laughs> put on the record and start playing it. That's a pin record. Okay, we're getting into, like, pin furniture now. And then there's a coupon, and then these ones are from the Disneyland Hotel. That's pretty colors. Over here, there's some princesses. Oh, it's been so long since I've seen that oh, one. Oh, yeah, the Mulan spinner one. What, are you checking to see if you have that on your board already? You made me get rid of it one day, and then you said I could have it back when we got it again. Oh, well, there you go. It all worked out. Yay! But that's kind of cool how the prince has the shoe. Uh, I, I can't remember if I've seen him with the shoe before now that I think about it. It looks like he's talking to Belle. <laughs> he's trying to figure out which princess is his. Who fits the shoe? And our last page here. Oh, this didn't open to this. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, this is, this is a nice classic one with black and white Mickeys and Walt. There are just so many great pins in that collection. I am so glad it finally arrived and the postal service did not lose my package. Woo, that was, that was a stressful two weeks for me. That'd be sad. Because it was a high value package, they insured it. But I didn't want the insurance payout if they lost it. I wanted the pins because there was some, there's so many great ones in there. So I'm so excited they're finally here. And now we have so many that we need to definitely add into our collection. But hopefully you guys enjoyed unboxing that with us. If you did, be sure to leave us a like down below. Subscribe if you want to see more videos just like this. Have a magical day.